Tuberculosis is a major public health problem in India. This is in spite of TB being a completely curable disease. Most of the TB burden countries have large private health care sector. India is not an exception. Around 60 to 70 percent of the patients see care in the private sector, which is diverse in size and settings. Hence, it is essential that we engage the private sector in the fight against TB. The private practitioners can start notifying the number of cases they are treating. This will give the government the exact number of TB patients and the clear picture of the TB epidemiology in the geographical region. Secondly, the private providers can link their patients with quality assured diagnosis and treatment which is available in the national TB program. This will help reduce the mortality and morbidity among the TB patients. There is a long delay in uh, diagnosing the TB patients. This is supplemented with stigma and further it deteriorates the patient cascade of care. Considering all this, if you are able to train and equip the private sector practitioners, they would be able to link the uh, patients to the national TB program. Several countries have been implementing some of the public-private partnership models to engage private sector providers in TB program. They have been using intermediary agencies such as faith-based organizations or it could be professional organizations or NGOs who work as an interface between the private sector and the national TB program. Some of the countries are even using national health insurance scheme as an interface to engage with the private practitioners. India has pioneered some of the most successful public-private partnership schemes in the TB elimination. After a decade of experience and innovations, Government of India has rolled out a scheme by name Patient Provider Support Agency, which is rolled out in the country now. We take you through a virtual visit of such three TB PPM models, which showcases on how to engage private sector with the government or with national TB program in practice. Join us to the virtual site visit to three projects in India. In the fight against tuberculosis in India, patients often find themselves in the private sector. Under the guidance of the National TB Elimination Program, the Patient Providers Support Agency or PPSA is bringing innovative solutions to reach people living with TB by engaging the private sector. Led by World Health Partners, the project is pushing the boundaries of TB care. This project isn't just about numbers, it's about people, their stories and their journey through TB care. WSP से सर आए और बताए आपको घबराने की कोई जरूरत नहीं है जो दवा दिया गया है बस उस पर ध्यान रखना है कि आप नियमित रूप से दवा खाएं With patient centered care getting more and more importance we have realized that TB is not a disease in isolation it affects a person Therefore, we need to treat the person and not just the illness. And an individual who has already been diagnosed with tuberculosis is at higher risk for developing mental health issues. It's a vicious circle. So we have to consider mental health issues right from the beginning of someone's TB journey and support them always. In the quest to end TB, the Indian government's commitment under the Prime Minister's office and the national strategic plan is paramount. The PPSA project, guided by the National TB Elimination Program, aims to increase TB notifications and ensure successful outcomes. Uh, this is possible to achieve only with the active participation of all stakeholders, government departments, NGOs, civil society organizations. One of the very important partners are our private practitioners, we have engaged a private partner, World Health Partners, in two districts of Punjab, Amritsar and Patiala, covering a population of about 5 million in the two districts. Their work has been really impressive 
and they have been able to enroll, enroll around more than 1,000 private uh, practitioners in the program with the notification of more than 13,000 uh, patients in the year 2023 till September. Today, the PPSA project is making a significant impact in high priority districts across three states Bihar, Punjab, and Odisha. Let's delve into the innovative models that are changing the game. In India, informal healthcare providers are often the first point of contact for urban slums and rural communities. Recognizing this, WHP has built a network of informal providers trained to identify TB cases, facilitate testing, and connect people living with TB with qualified doctors. WHP's Centralized Control Center the CCC plays a pivotal role. It coordinates service delivery, manages referrals, ensures adherence to the treatment plans, conducts client satisfaction surveys and even offers teleconsultation. CCC has become a lifeline for those needing long-term follow-up in TB treatment. Simplifying TB treatment is vital. WHP has ensured the availability of fixed dose combination, FDC drugs in private facilities and pharmacies within the PPSA project areas. Workplaces such as small and medium factories have been left out of TB screening and treatment. During the project implementation, we found out that screening, sensitization and case finding had not just increased the awareness and knowledge of TB among these factory workers, but also has helped them gain confidence to seek timely care and treatment. The PPSA project is not only increasing TB notifications from private sector, but is also ensuring successful treatment outcomes. By engaging informal providers, establishing a centralized control center, and providing free FDC drugs, WHP and its partners are revolutionizing TB care in India. The engagement of private providers, formal and informal, under the PPSA project is setting an excellent example of an accessible and equitable TB care model in India. World Health Partners and its associates remain committed to the cause of ending TB. In the fight against tuberculosis, India has taken innovative strides to engage the private healthcare sector. India's National TB Elimination Programme stands as a beacon of hope, striving to eliminate TB. However, it faces significant challenges. Despite their potential, many private healthcare providers operate independently, often without aligning with national healthcare programmes or guidelines. Need of the hour is to find solutions to improve private sector engagement. Doctors for You began working as PPSA since 2019. Within a span of four years, we have expanded to 83 districts of India. We have notified more than 1 lakh TB patients from the private sector. Engaging private providers has not been an easy task. We had to find out innovative solutions like incentivizing private provider staff for reaching out to TB patients, deploying our own lab technicians at government laboratories to conduct NAT tests for confirming TB, at the same time engaging pharmacists for fixed dose combination drugs to provide quality treatment to the TB patients. This is the story of Doctors For You and their transformative work in TB care. At the core of Doctors For You's approach, is the PPSA model, Patient Provider Support Agency. This innovative model focuses on patient-centric care, emphasizing prevention, diagnosis, and support for both patients and healthcare providers. When a patient is diagnosed and seeking TB care, the doctor prescribes the WHO-recommended nucleic acid amplification test and provides a chest X-ray voucher. Using the voucher, the patient visits a lab impaneled by DFI 
entitling them to a free chest x-ray from a private provider. The doctor prescribes a government-approved fixed-dose combination and refers the patient to the nearest impaneled chemist. DFI's treatment coordinator calls the patient to create an appointment for a home visit. The agency actively updates TB notifications and other essential data in the NICSHARE portal, contributing to better tracking and management. The treatment coordinator collects the patient's bank details for money transfer for nutrition support. और मेडिसिन भी फ्री में मिल रहा है और हर महीने 500 रुपया बैंक स्टेटमेंट देने के बाद वो भी आ रहा है मतलब मेरे को बहुत हेल्प हुआ कोई टेंशन नहीं है मेरा इलाज बच्चे का अच्छे से चल रहा है मेरे को टाइम टू टाइम मेडिसिन मिल रहा है और यहाँ पे हॉस्पिटल में मेरा काफी हेल्प कर रहे हैं लोग कोई प्रॉब्लम नहीं है मेरे को हर तरीके से सपोर्ट मिला है यहाँ पे दिस इज द जर्नी ऑफ अ पेशेंट विद डॉक्टर्स फॉर यू ensuring a comprehensive and supportive healthcare experience jab se doctors for you ngo hamare sath partnership mein as a ppsa aaya hai tab se hamara jo private sector ka notification hai kafi bada hai prevention is the first line of defense doctors for you is actively involved in spreading awareness about tb its symptoms and the importance of early detection our partnerships with the state governments and the ntp has been very transformative this is the power of partnership innovation and commitment in the battle against tb together we can surely make india tb free through community engagement they are empowering individuals to take charge of their health doctors for you stands as a beacon of hope through the ppsa model they are not just treating tb They are transforming communities and shaping a healthier future. Visit their website or contact them to find out how you can make a difference in the fight against tuberculosis. Tuberculosis is a major public health problem in India. In 2020, India accounted for 26% of the TB global incident cases. Thambi ko nandu the. Thambi ko nandu the. Adhika apna aunu treatment pa kame. Aunu life aunu paalai. Once the patient is diagnosed with TB, the common thing they face is social marginalization of the patients, and because of the financial deprivation. Uh, they don't continue the treatment regularly vella nenichu andha maathire podama irundano nammal theriyadhu andha poi nanga uyiru utta perukku asathe perukku anga kam office vera seithu poi paatha appo back nere maathire vechirukanga 80% of the patients first point of contact is the general practitioner or the family physician who has to do the initial diagnosis the the problem lies with the patient also because for the first one week of symptoms he goes to one doctor then the next one week of symptoms he goes to the next doctor so the cumulative period of delay in treatment is attributable to many doctors Hi I am Dr Ramya Anantakrishnan uh, director of REACH 
reach in its 25 years of journey has played an important role in developing, conceptualizing and implementing a private sector model for TB care in India. The REACH Nakshatra model respects a person with TB's choice to choose care either in the public sector or in the private sector. The main focus of the Nakshatra model are the Nakshatra centers housed in private hospitals across the Chennai city. The private practitioners also came forward to provide a space in their hospitals, in their hospital premises, to function as a centre for TB care services. This project has been designed in close consultation with private practitioners, chest physicians, general practitioners and leading TB experts. Being a private hospital, we do get patients from the low socioeconomic class. So uh, one is the diagnosis, the other one is the treatment. Both ways they helped us because uh, expert uh, TB, the test that we do for diagnosing tuberculosis in a short duration, it's available in a few labs in Chennai, but it's very expensive. The gene expert MTB assay is a, a, a cartridge-based automated test that not only detects the presence of TB bacteria, but also detects resistance to the rifampicin drug. Ever since this gene expert was installed in the center, we've been seeing increasing number of patients referred by private practitioners and a large number of patients are being benefited by this facility here. Rapid diagnosis with the gene expert test therefore helps TB patients to be started on treatment as early as possible. <laughs> Private sector engagement models such as REACH helps in a win-win situation for all the stakeholders concerned. The public health program gets their share of notification and an understanding of how people in the private sector get care and support. Patients receive services like counselling on drug adherence, uh, monitoring of treatment, risk assessment and nutritional support. Make sure you take frequent nutritious food during your treatment. After a couple of months, you will start feeling better. You will start enjoying your food more and you will gain weight. These are signs of well-being. At no point should you stop taking your medication. I would say for sure that most of the patients who have been diagnosed as uh, pulmonary tuberculosis have completed the course uh, with much ease, you know, receiving a lot of benefits, not just by taking regular drugs and close monitoring alone, but also through the add-on add facilities, you know, which they are currently enjoying. So this is a win-win for all the stakeholders concerned. My name is Chitra. In my name is Kalpana. I have worked in the reach for the past 18 years. The TB Nanban play a vital role in ensuring that once a person with symptom of TB enters a Nakshatra care model, they are followed up, counseled and provided care and support. I have a support group meeting. I have a patient 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 meeting. Treatment is a treatment that is a treatment that is a This is emerged as an excellent model wherein we bridge the gap between the private practitioners, the government and the people suffering with TB. This also has increased the notification many fold from the private sector towards the TB elimination program. So we are very happy with this model and it's been implemented across the entire Chennai Corporation. The success of this private sector engagement model is a trust that private practitioners have in the system. They do not lose their people with TB. They retain their consultation fees 
and the TB Nanbans play a vital role and act as a bridge in supporting their people with TB, thereby increasing footfall to their clinics. The only way we can end TB in India is to successfully engage the private health sector and the only way we can engage private sector is to have an intermediary, a support mechanism to act as a bridge between the public sector and the private sector. With such promising innovations happening in, in India, we hope Indian government will be able to achieve TB elimination by 2025. TB harega, desh jitega.